this is my official month one recap. Yeah, I'm about a week late. More than a week late. Month one recap of the Kinky Nappy Happy Protective Style Challenge for the six months of 2000, three months of 2012 and two, 2013. Okay, let's get started. Protective Style Challenge September, started September 22nd and in, um, the first month ended on October 22nd. The first week, I think I wore my hair in a pinup or pulled back. I pulled back with a ponytail and a flat twisted bang and um, tucked the ponytail in. And then I washed it, put it in a twist. And then I wore the twist for like two weeks. And then I washed and put in more twists when I got the Shea Moisture product, which is a video that you'll see somewhere before or after this. Um, then I took those twists out, those twists out for a twist out for a day. Well, it was supposed to be for two days. And then it turned out to be three days. And because I was twisting every night, it was really stretched. So I decided instead of washing my hair before putting my yarn wraps in, I put my yarn wraps in over my three-day-old twist out, which was no deal. So what I did was I took my hair, and when I did each section, I uh, moisturized it with, I took some Shea Moisture mask, some Shea Moisture leave-in, I mean conditioner, so two Shea Moisture products little aloe vera juice, castor oil, olive oil, something else on each section. Took my detangling comb, detangled it, do, 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 do. got to the end, clip, 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 twist, 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 do the yarn wrap. <coughs> Excuse me. And so therefore my, my ends have been clipped. Okay, I cut more, I didn't clip the ends in the top, I cut the top because some of the different spots that are growing in, you know, they start growing at different times and they're growing at different rates. And so I had like this. So anyway, so the twists that had very uneven, I just cut them till they were even. Then that way, it'll start growing out evenly. And I'll probably be doing another cut during this particular style challenge because I'm not trying to retain length at this point. I am, I do want to retain length, but if you watch Vandy on 925's channel... I want to retain length, but I don't want to have the scraggly end. You know how you do the love trick, and then it's like this is one little piece that's down here, and the rest of it's up here. And then when you do your twist out, it's like you know see through on the end. And then because I've been a video about this before too, so I'm gonna cut it some because it is growing. So I'm not worried about it. It's gonna grow. I'm not gonna be waist length about it in the next year, but <laughs> I will. However long it is, it will be a nice um, head of hair. Um, so the second month, I think it's regular regimen, and I don't know how I missed the thing for this month, but I saw, um, Miss Stokes' video and somebody else. So anyway, so month two is regular regimen. I, the only regimen I'm having is a, is a moisturizing regimen, and if I have issues with my scalp, I'm going to, um, figure out how I want to cleanse and do my scalp. Um... I will be probably redoing some of the first wraps that I put in, but uh, I'll let you guys know how that go. So the month of November, I'll just be moisturizing my yarn locks, and when my products get here, I'll probably would not want to take my yarn locks out because I want to play in these products. Well, I don't have anything to play in, so I'm going to take my Shea Butter and Mango to make a mix, a moisturizing mix, so I'll probably use that on my scalp face and hair, um, like I used to. Um... So that'll probably be it because the um, Be Mine is a deep is a deep conditioner. I know how that works. So I'm not I'm not in a hurry to do that. This when I take it down, that's what I will be deep conditioning with. I, I'm experimenting now with the Shea Moisture, but I think when I take these down, I need to go what I know is tried and true. Okay, and then we'll go back to the Shea Moisture. Um, so yeah, so my regimen right now is getting back on my moisturizing game. Um, do I plan on styling these locks outside of a ponytail? I don't think I'll be pinning them anytime soon. Um, pinning them up or anything of that nature. But other than pulling them back in a ponytail or something like this. 
And they're not even red. Like, they're all uneven. I don't know if I'm going to even them up or not. Because, like I said in the other video, I'll have issues with my yarn length. But, yeah. So, that's about it. So, I look forward to seeing everybody else in their updates. And good luck and happy growing. Bye-bye.